Harry's promotions, it's just all about getting back to the basics. You know, for people who are who are fans of, of boxing and, and, and fight fans, they want to see knockouts. They want to see interesting, compelling matchups where styles sort of at times leave you breathless. They want the crazy knockouts. They want the drama. And that's what we're going to be doing at Aries Promotions. We're going to be putting together fights that matter here in the Capital Region, cultivating exciting fighters. But in the process, putting together matchups, they'll just leave you on the edge of the seat when you come to one of our boxing shows. And on April 25th, no exception. Every single fight contains that element of, wow, something explosive could happen at any second. You definitely don't want to I'm fighting for my family, like always. I fly to put bread on the table. I got a new, new belly coming. You know, so I got my first firstborn child coming up. So that's that's a plus for me. That's a bigger motivation. So fighting for myself, for my fans out in Puerto Rico, my Albany people. And this is to keep putting bread in the table, man. That's that's why I do this. This is my business. This is my job. I have a daughter on the way. Any day I'm waiting for her to come. I'm dedicating the fight to her. I train very hard. She's always on my mind. You know, I want to make her proud. You know, starting to raise a family. So. That's what it's about, you know, starting to raise a family and, you know, putting us, our, me and my family in a better position. He's definitely on the cusp of doing something big. We'll find out this year, for sure. So this is something for the fans. People that really like boxing are going to get a, a really two fights, the main and the co-main, and the call it fights, 50-50 fights. It's all about, you know, I think about my daughter all the time. She's not here yet, but she's on her way. And, uh... You know, I, I think about it constantly, and it means everything to, to give her everything that I never had. You know, that's pretty much what it is. You know, even if I can't get to a world title or make it to that million dollar fight, at least I tried. I'm, I'm gonna try my very best to, to give her everything she, she wants and needs. So that's what it's about. You know, I hope I can get a lot of people to come out and cheer me on and cheer mm -hmm. the whole opening boxing, you know, because boxing is a great sport, you know. like. People think about boxing, you think about the violence and all that stuff, but now there is no, you know, every time you come in here, you don't see no fights. Nobody fight people. They got rings in, but you don't see nobody trying to fight one another, nothing. Even boxing, you know, boxing gym is better than even going to a regular gym where you lift weights. Everybody's humble, you know, everybody's humble, they do everything, you know, they focus. So I hope I can get the fans to come out, you know, and check open on and we doing we doing good thing, you know. You know, want to put boxing on the map again. So, you know, I really over the past couple of months have been really excited watching Joe mature inside the gym from an amateur, uh, just kind of you know learning his way under Andy and Kyle's tutelage. Yeah. This kid is explosive. He's got power. He's going to come at his opponent, and he's going to be looking for a vicious knockout April 25th. I can't wait for Joe Bolo's pro debut. It's going to be amazing. I'm really excited about this fight. You know, I've had a couple fights fall out. Uh, two times actually, so I feel like I've been training for six months for this fight. My last fight was uh, back in December, or I'm sorry, back in September uh, in California, which was an awesome experience, a great trip, so I'm definitely, definitely ready to get out there and to see my fans again. I haven't fought at home since June, and that was a great match for me. That was a great fight, and I'm excited to show everybody what I've been working on, try, always trying to improve, always trying to get better. Uh, training camp is, Stellar is always, you know, the one thing about boxing is it's 90% uh, mental and this training camp has been especially mentally challenging for me personally so I've been having to fight through it and get to where I want to be and come the 25th I'll be able to show not only that I'm a really strong person in the ring but that I'm mentally a really strong person too so I'm excited about that.